Once a man tried to sell a turd. It seemed stupidly absurd. Children laughed in his face, he was his parents' disgrace. Crossing the country to sell his turd, he was always deterred. However beautiful his chatter, he couldn't sell that brown matter. What shall I do? Then right on cue, a splendiferous brainwave, a spontaneous save. He knew what he needed, then he proceeded. On a plane off he went, feeling content. Trying one final time as the plane started to climb, he asked a passenger please, would you like some feces? The look he got next seemed to be one of vex. The man swapped his seat, our hero realised defeat. The battle may be lost, but the war is not tossed. As the aircraft landed, his excitement expanded. A ride along a dirt track with an animal attack. Feeling quite unfit, he reached a village round a pit. The pit was made of poo, used I think as glue, possibly like clay, to shape their cooking bay. He was in the heart of a tribe that are yet to subscribe to the modern ways of the West, beautifully simple, not complex. Our protagonist pitched the opportunity to the head of the community. Unfortunately, turd was not required. The plan had backfired. But the leader of the clan said, why not stay, young man? We have many a role to fulfil your soul. The man looked at his poo, crying, what shall I do? Do I give up my business life, stay here without the strife? This place is completely unknown, even without a phone. But it could be an adventure, better than a business venture. Okay, the man heartily shouted. I can't say I'm undoubted, but I commit myself to this. I seal it with a kiss. The leader was taken surprised the decision was authorised. Granted he couldn't sell his turd, but let's be honest, that was absurd.